Howdy ho! Everyone! Velocity here, back in action for the final team member attraction. That's right, I'm trying to get a glimmit. And those glimmits are hard to get because they are just very not there, you feel me? And suffice to say, I need to figure out what I need to put on here to make sure that I get this darn thing. And thankfully, I actually have Total here to do that for me. Because, geez louise, you would not want to like destroy this thing. Sandstorm is fine, I'm pretty sure I'm part round, so we're all good there. So, let's go ahead. Oh, super effective. Mega Drain is mild, so we'll just do stun into Mega Drain. Beno Shock! That's not the best. Jeez, mister. Why are you gonna do this to me? <sighs> Alright. We, did we not get it? Did we not get the paralysis? Please, buddy. Buddy boo. There we go. We got the paralysis. This is fantastic. It will make things much easier for the next bits. Uh... This is massive damage to a target. I don't want to do massive damage to a target. I do not want to kill this thing. I do want it to go down a little bit, but like, it's pretty rare to actually go find one and just like, literally I found one of them, accidentally killed it, and now we're here, fam. We're just totally right here. I'm just like, I don't want anything bad to happen. I'll try to make sure that I, I take it slow. And Santi. But it failed. Of course it failed. And the sandstorm subsided, subsided, of course. Oh, no, it's raining. There we go. We got it. We got it. This should be good enough. I was trying to figure out what Pokeball to actually put it in before I started recording. Uh, because I wanted to go find it first. And now that I've found it, I actually know which one to go with. Um... I was thinking net ball, dive ball, or um, the dusk ball. But like, it's all purple, right? Or, or like, kind of bluish. And I read a great ball. So, it just seems to me that one of these two choices is the best one, either the net or the dive. But considering the way that it is, just, it looks too blue not to, you know? So please get in here. I would like you very much. Uh, of course not. Can't move because it's paralyzed. Yeah, that's what I thought. Like, honestly, bud, it will be a lot easier if you just get in the ball. Yeah, crit. One. There you go, baby. And of that, we've officially gotten all our team members together. This is good. This is good. Limit. Uh, it absorbs nutrients from cave walls. The petals it wears are made with of crystallized poison. Yeah, they're small little buggers. Just look how this little thing. It's so small. So this Pokemon in particular uh, was actually a name that my boyfriend came up with. And as you can tell, they're a very hungry bitch. You feel me? Definitely one of those situations where, like, they got food on the brain, and honestly, I don't know why I bother to ask sometimes. Because every time I'm like, hey, significant other that I love so dearly, could you please name this for me? And they're like, mm, my interest. Every time. I don't know why I think it's going to be something different and it's super creative. But I also find this incredibly cute, and I think scrambled uh, eggs... Fits it pretty well, so naming it just scrambles uh, really helps with the whole entire like limits, little um, nature and and uh, what it does as uh, basically a hazard setter. That's that's what they're supposed to be doing. You saw a bit of it with Sandstorm, but they also have a thing with uh, toxic spikes, I believe. Suffice to say, I love it. And yeah, of course we're gonna add scrambles to our party. 
I was not expecting a nearly all female party to be honest because I was just gonna take the next one that I could get with a uh, Wimlet. But now that we have that under control here, uh, is it this? Is is it this? Oh, please, um, please. There you go. Map. With that being said, uh, it had to be got here, and as you could tell, we, we already got done with the gym and everything, and everything that we wanted to do with the situation. So that means we have to head all the way over here and do more Starfall bits and anything else in between. Oh, question mark? Why is there a question mark there? Why, why is that the case? Suffice to say, I will see you all over there, okay? Well, 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 look what we have here. Ah, it's just right here. Gotta get all the way over to there. And we've already explored this little spot right here. Um, so, yeah. Let's just continue on our little merry way. But first, I actually have a pleasant surprise for you. For this two-for-one deal is not just uh, a promotion anymore. For you see... I have the malicious armor that I could use to level up our good old Battlenet. What? Battlenet is evolving? Yo, baby! Your Battlenet evolved into a ser a Serul Alleg. Get it? <laughs> <laughs> I did funny. The fiery blades on its arms burned fiercely with the lingering resentment of a sword wielder who fell before accomplishing their goal. Yosh! Fantastic! I would also like to mention here, this was a particular thing that a good uh, friend of mine uh, gave me, uh, Katie, uh, I'll put little links down below. She does fun little bits with my friend Skulls902. Uh, and she is... Well, they are very, um... They're very, like, singy-singy-talk type person. You feel me? So they're a fun hang for sure. So, like, if you want to, like, go check them out or something, they are super generous. They were able to give me this, and I really did need it. And I'm ever so pleased to have it. Uh, but for that, yes, of course, we're going to learn Shadow Claw. How much does it do? It's crit? Is... Yeah, they're, they're attack. They, they are so attack. Yes. Well, there we go. So we have one, two Pokemans to go to, like, fully level up and, like, be something. So this is pretty great, actually. That's for you. I didn't actually check any of your moves or your things. Relax, I think, will be fine. Uh, its speed is whatever. Its speed is down. Its defense is up, which I'm not inherently against. But it seems to be a special attacker. Which, I'll be real, I totes forgot what else I would want. Well, considering everything, yeah, let's let's give it ancient power. Uh, we don't need Sandstorm. We're not a Sandstorm team, unfortunately. Okay, and then let's remember another move. <coughs> Acid Spray. User attacks harshly lowers. So, this would actually be pretty good, but I think it ha yeah, it's Venom Shock on it. So we would need something to, like, poison, if anything. We mostly got, like, rock and poison stuff, though. Stealth rocks would be set up pretty well. Rock polish, I'm not exactly too keen on, to be real. Mm. Yeah, we'll, we'll just keep it up there. That's fine. I was thinking of an otherwise thing, but honestly, I, I can't think to myself anything in particular would be good about it. Either way, uh... We haven't, like, really explored this little tiny bit, I think. I think we got those ones. I think they're all counted as, like, one thing in particular. Which should be fine. Let's grab these. 
really quick like I can't wait to actually like go over there and everything oh dang bulls over the dang place oh thank you anything else anything else no this is good all right I didn't think there was gonna be a whole lot of other things around here Although I will say that I'm generally surprised that I haven't been able to find the Mises, like, at all. Like, I've probably seen them and I just didn't challenge them or some such, but, like, for real. Like, they, they just don't show up for me. They do not like me. The straights don't like me. I don't know what to tell you. Maybe that's my whole problem. Alright, let's just go ahead and go off to our little bit piece here. I don't think we got that one. Did we? Did we get you yet? Arr, oh, little baby. No, we got you. I'm gonna leave. I don't need to be here. Okay. So that's gonna be a little bit piece. There it is. Right there. Waha. What do you have to say, sir? Oh, he just wants battles. They always want battles. Uh, yeah. Here we off to. Been a while since we take down uh, any of uh, Team Star, but we had to do it at some point, right? Well, Cyclone. Like Cyclar. Like Pretty sure we got all these these little buds <laughs> up and at them. Oh, hey, what up? Grab? Grab? Ooh, I don't think we have Rain Dance. I don't think we need Rain Dance either, but that's that's another thing. This is fantastic to see. Getting back at it, Mon Cherry. Kind of surprised how much that took. Oh, it's you, Lost! Uh, Clef? Yep, that's me, Clef, the normal academy student. Anyway, Lost, I owe you one. Thanks to you, I've been accepted into Operation Starfall. Yeah, what's your endgame, bud? I need answers, that's all. How do I resolve this situation with Team Star? What's causing its members' odd behavior? Odd behavior? Team Star is the subject of more than a few nasty rumors that swirl around that academy, you know? Some say their bullying has caused a worrying number of students to drop out of school. Others say they're holed up in a basis, plotting to cause trouble for the academy. But these are rumors. No matter I am directly confronted with something else. I'm talking about Team Star's persistency. Uh, persistent truancy. They've all been skipping cast class for a while now. Five of them in particular. The so-called bosses of Team Star. I haven't so much as set foot inside the classroom for over a year. It seems the team's rank and file have recently started stirring up mischief as well. That's why I took it upon myself to issue a direct order to Team Star to disband. I informed them should they refuse, I would have no choice but to expel my students affiliated with their team. But I'm afraid there's been no response, and the deadline I set for them to make their choice between disillusion uh, or expulsion nigh upon us. But you see, when I overheard you talking about the f on the phone to Cassiopeia, it couldn't have come at a more crucial time. Oh! It's a rototototoing! Ahem. 
An another time. Be careful. I see you're coming up to one of Team Star's bases. Was there someone with you just now? Nobody was here, that's right. Just little old me. Wow. Be warned that Team Star will have its guard up after losing one boss to you already. This base won't go down as easily as the last one. Proceed with extreme caution. I'll be in touch. Extreme caution? Like... Cautious that a duck will attack me? Well, I still have things over here to go get, so... Let me just grab it real quick, and I'll, I'll be on my merry way. Oh, they're blocking that spot. Fair enough. Alright, bud. I'm here to challenge you. Take your crops. Take your oil paintings. Anything. As long as I get mine, you feel me? Whoa, whoa, you can't be here. This base belongs to Team Star. If you don't clear out real quick, like, I'll have to come in at your self defense. You get me? Yeah, I'm not turning back, bud. Th that's not gonna happen. Well, all right, time for me to sell defense of the snot right out of ya. Why am I so far away? Wah! <coughs> Team Star is here. And honestly, fam, be kind of queer. Both in the weird sense and in the, well, you know, general queer energy sense. And honestly, good for them. There's only one, so ancient power it is. Oh, look at that. Oh my god. That's fantastic, really. Oh, that's cute. It has little fossils now. It used to just be like a little, little, little rock things. Yeah! Look, look at our scrambles go. I defended myself alright, but it wasn't enough. Man, you're crazy strong! Wait, are you that kid who declared war on the Team Star? Call me lost. Because I don't know where I am right now. And frankly, I don't think this is the bathroom. Whoa, thanks for the terrible news. Please don't poop on me. Excuse me, while I book it back for the rest of the crew. Hasta la vista! And then off he went. Hey, Lost! Castle Fear told me to uh, scoop out uh, the fire crew's uh, base. I thought I'd come uh, give you some backup now that I'm through. But it seems you're all set. What? What's with the flume? What? The flume? <gasps> Stinder Ace! Oh, wait, is that... Carlos? What? Is that you, Carlos? Oh, Charlos. CHARLOS! Oh, I thought so. What are you doing here? You know this little fella? This is Carlos, uh... Uh, uh Car Cadet. What do you mean, Flume? I'm pretty sure she's still working. He's one of the Pokemon the Academy uh, takes care of within its grounds. Wow, he's really angry about that. Or was he happy? Can't tell with him. Not Carlos White! He ran off! Looks like he may have some connection to Team Star's fire crew. I better chase after him. Don't worry. I'll recruit with you soon enough. You press ahead into the base, Lost. Sure, I'll go do all the work then. Because apparently somebody has to. What? I see you dealt with the grunt standing guard. Nice work. I mean, I like to think it's nice work, you know? But this is me. 
doing my job. Stationed inside that base is Team Star's fire crew. The Skadar Squad. Their boss, Mela, is the best all-rounder of the team. She fixes any and every problem thrown her way, though her methods are heavy-handed. Our declaration of war must have made her blood boil. Why? Why, why would someone have their blood boil over just simple war? Is this not simply how we declare things? Like, the Southerners do it all the time. Why am I getting in trouble for that? I bet even now, her grunts are hard at work inside the base, trying to keep her fury under control. That means your best move is to take down all the grunts nice and quick. Once there's no one left to help Mela keep her cool, she should come out to confront you. Ring the bell on the gates once you're ready to kick off this phase of the operation. Time to wipe the Skadar squad off the map. All right, well, time to do, uh, well, I probably shouldn't say that. I probably should take that luckily as a joke, you feel me? Regardless, let's flame me out, baby. Team of three? Yeah, sure, let's bring a team of three. Oh, the first team of three. Uh-oh. I did not do the first team of three like I should have. So kid looked out beating one of our sister squads. And now she thinks she can take us on. Time to give her the boot, gang. Let's show this Gate Crasher what Team Star can do. If you're listening, Gate Crasher, know this. Unless you beat that of our Pokemon in 10 minutes, our boss won't lift a finger to deal with the likes of you. Well, I, I hope I have enough. Let's do this, baby. Tickles! Get him! Get him! Oh, I could bring this one out to you. Ooh, a little ostrich boy! And this one should have, like, the flame thing, so we should be pretty good. I think we'll be able to do this. Send out! Bud, you're getting slaughtered here in the DMs. What are you doing? Get it. Get him, my powerful little ostrich. Do your best. I probably should be sticking around more, to be honest. It seems like I'm just not sticking around to see them, like, destroy things. Look at Scrambles go! Heck yeah. Go, Scrambles! It's your birthday! I like it's an omelet birthday. Get it. Get the Growlis. And then you. I love our little scrambles. They're just doing their best, you know? I just love them so much. I'm not done slaughtering. Let me slaughter some more. Oh, the fit is on breach! It's all up to the boss now! Oh no. The boss doing here? Do they all have fancy cars, every one of them? Aren't they like kids? Or at least teenagers? Oh god. Um, uh, what? Huh? She's a cutie! So you're the dope who picked a fight with Team Star. I don't know why you do something so stupid. Now I don't care. You challenge us, so we'll beat you down. That's all there is to it. Prepare to get messed up. Wait a minute. Bam! She looks like a Zooey. 
This is just Kazooie Genki-fied. That's fucking Kazooie! Where's Banjo? Where's the turtle? I love my turtle. Turtle, turtle. Right here, right now. They're going down! Drought? Yo! It has drought? What? So let's set up Stealth Rock, because scummy, scummy, scum, scum. We should be able to last at least one turn. Uh, this move will torture you till there's nothing left but ash. Flame Wheel? Oh jeez. Not very effective, but it did do ouchie. Oh good, good. There's two things that happened. That was for the rest of the uh, Cedric squad. Okay. But what if... Now hear me out on this. I, I just went blasting on you. Oh, that wasn't enough blasting! Oh no! Boy. So we could probably switch in our team member. Because... Yeah. Oh, hey, what up? We got several team members here today. Uh, I guess it's just for the first part? So let's swap in Battle.net. Come on. Good switch in. Good switch in. Premier debut. Thank you. Hee 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 hee. Yeah, Clear Smaw, Shadow Claw. Well, Shadow Claw is obviously the thing we want the most. Yeah, baby. Beverum? I ain't been to a Chris just yet. <laughs> yes. Good, good. Um. We could will it wisp this bitch. Screech? Oh no, that's bad. That means we'll have to leave, which is fine. It, oh, they're fire? Oh no, they have speed boost. I do not like that. I do not like that one bit. Well. <laughs> I think... I think this does it for both sides? All stat changes were eliminated. Yo, what up? So they're only gonna have like one speed boost or two effectively. So I'm fine with that. This just literally means that I have to do I have to cycle between Shadow Claw and uh, Clear Smog. Which is fine by me. Ooh, those speed boosts are scary though. They're very scary. See, he keeps screeching me. That's not nice. Why would you do that? Battle.net is a home hero, you feel me? It does its best to be what it is. As the only boy member of the crew, it has to look the most Mega Man-y. Because if it doesn't, well, it's not that I wouldn't love it any less, it's just more so like, be really weird like we named it Battle.net, you know? So they're going through our identity crisis. Mm. Yeah, I'm just gonna clear. Yep, keep doing that thing. Oh! Can they not hit me? Yo, can they actually just not hit me? Okay, but I can't go any lower. I think it can only hit me with Screech. Oh my god, I think we locked it down. But do you only have fire type attacks? Poor little Kazooie. Yeah. Hmm. Is this really how it's gonna end? What a hassle. About a year and a half ago. Man, what a hassle. Pulled it off just in time. 
Wait, who's saying that? We managed to get a bunch of uh, Carcadet to evolve. That'll be enough power uh, to stop mobile and finally get that hunk uh, metal rolling. Glad tidings indeed. Is it not so, Ortigiga? Uh, Ortiga? Ortiga? Like Olga? Uh, Orta? Ortiga? I'm just surprised um, uh, she's not all hot air. Oh, shut it with the snipe uh, comments. You could be such an annoying twip, you know that? As if you're any better, <laughs> Mila. Being rude and saying mean things is literally your whole deal. That's not true. Or T. The girls of the Academy have always been jealous of how cute Melly is. She just puts on a surly attitude so they'll stop picking on her. Oh, I love that. That's really cute. And though, I guess you're not wrong to say that her surly attitude is what people know her for. What? Come on! Not you too, Harry! How about we leave it at that, folks? It's almost time for the big event. Yes. Operation Star. It's finally happening. And the big boss? What? Prey is their plan? They already got in touch with all the bullies and asked them to head over to the schoolyard. It's finally time, huh? Man, I'm so stoked. The rail's burning me right up. I burned through everything I had. Now I split it out. Guess this is where it ends. The gleaming of yours really let us have it. Beating me in battle is a huge deal. So here, take this star badge and be proud of yourself. Oh my god, that's so cute! Like she beat us up. <laughs> we're, we're, oh no, she just has strong hands. Heck yeah. Love, I love Kazooie Girl. Well, not it. You can have this TM too. Not like I'm going to use it. Okay. Yeah, I know what flame charge is. I'll make one thing clear. I'm not giving this to you. I'm giving them to your Glimit. She's a Sundari. She's soon soon. Got what you came for. Now leave me alone. You're Mela from the Team Star, all right? There's a Pokemon I'd like you to see. Huh? Where are you supposed to be? Oh, well, yeah, I guess she does kind of resemble that. A car cat it. Wait. <laughs> Would you say it like that, though? My name Carlos. What are you doing here? The MC came to the space looking for you. This <laughs> is what is this guy on, man? Like, honestly. It did? Very attached to you, isn't he? Yeah, because I used to play with him every day. Back when I was still going to school. You can even tell more or less what he's thinking just by looking at the way his flames move. Do you have any idea why Carlos wanted to visit you? Oh, he just misses his friend. Carlos. To me, it looks like he's saying that he wants you to come back. You said it already, would ya? They say Team Star has holed itself up in these bases. Not something against the Academy. Were you aware of this? First I've heard of a stupid rumor like that. Man, 
Nothing's changed since back then. Everyone's just spouting garbage. Then what about that modified car you were monitoring uh, around in just now? Star Mobile? We made that thing a long time ago to help us out with the big fight. We never actually used it against anyone before you two came looking for trouble. You never used it before. And was this about a, a big fight? You ever heard of Operation Star? Operation Star? Not Operation Starfall? No. This is the first I'm hearing of it. Huh. Yeah, I guess you wouldn't know. For me, the rest of Team Star, the memory will always cherish. Yeah, I, I, I know it's you. I take it that Mela Star Batch is now in your possession? I mean, hopefully she doesn't really, you know, try to take it back, so yeah, I guess it would be in my possession. I see. Now that there's no boss to lead them, the rest of the Skadar squad shouldn't last long. Mela. Sorry, I got distracted for a second there again. Now, about your reward, I'll transfer some LP over to your phone, as promised. Heck yes! Haha! <laughs> Easy points, baby! Ooh. Use those new TMS to strengthen your Pokemon even further. I'll have my supply unit rep meet you shortly to deliver some bonus materials, too. Uh, uh, hello. It's me again. I'm from the supply unit. Oh, You got a sandwich on you? <laughs> That's what you get for having sandwiches. Eh, it drooled all over me. What even is that Pokemon anyway? <laughs> it's really awesome. I have I know I have no idea what it is, but it likes sandwiches. So it can't all be evil. What makes you so calm with a giant question mark of a Pokemon at your side? Uh, um, but before I forget, here's your reward. Ooh, materials. Uh, your name's lost, right? Since you're part of Operation Starfall's battle unit, can I ask you something? What do you think of Team Star? They're not all that pretty strong for what they are. Interesting. You know, some of the rumors say Team Star wasn't always a bunch of delinquents. Most of them used to be victims of bullying, or they just found it hard to interact with people. When these misfits and outsiders found each other and banded together to form Team Star, all they wanted to do was push back against the bullies they couldn't face alone. But uh, that's just info I got by uh, hacking other students' social media accounts. I also found talk about some secret mastermind behind the five bosses. Someone who recruited uh, them to the team in the first place. I don't normally talk this much, and now my throat kind of hurts. I'm not gonna lie, my ex had that problem. 
like legitimately like we weren't used to like talking i was just like oh i like that they talked to me though i really did uh but i've been trying to keep a bit of a distance if only for the fact that even though nothing bad happened with that situation it was more a matter of like trying to help self help health healthy boundaries you know still i i do want her to talk more and interact with more people and I still like her. I still think that she's the bee's knees. So, um, good luck with taking down the other faces and stuff. I just know she has blue hair. Well, with that being said, y'all, I think we did a real good bit here to actually, like, get that all together. And with that being said, that will be it for today. Thank you all for watching. Sayonara. Bye-bye. <laughs>